Have you ever had a great idea for something that could change your life or change the lives of others, but you just didn't have the time or resources to see it through? Sometimes, all it takes to change the world is for someone to support your vision. I think the fact that we get many, many teachers applying for grants, both individual grants and big idea grants every year, tells us that they view the foundation as a real source to promote innovation and their ideas. Some examples would be our voice mentor program, which was first brought into my office way back when I was a principal and quickly expanded out and now we have voice mentors throughout the district in every school. Financial literacy, our program that is junior achievement, started at a middle school and now financial literacy is a part of what we do for every eighth grade student. I have to believe that much of that wouldn't happen had it not been for that seed money provided from the foundation. There is no art teacher here in the Issaquah schools. The state of Washington says that all children should receive art education and they do not fund for that. Art docent program bridges that gap. It brings in parent volunteers who teach art to our students. Our docents have received some excellent training from Art East and we feel that the training that they've provided has made our docents much more confident in their abilities to connect with students and you know bring their training into the actual classroom environment. It has been shown in many studies that when children have art they also do well in other subject areas. Thanks to donors we have found an innovative way to meet the needs of art education in our school. Thank you for bringing art to our school. It's pretty cool when you've built a guitar. After you're done, you walk out of there with a guitar. It's a lot of precision woodworking. There's a lot of science involved. There's a lot of math involved. There's electronics involved. When you walk out of here, it's like, wow, this is a pretty cool thing. I mean, I built this. And I've always wanted to like start playing guitar and like learn more about it. And so I was totally like, I'm in for that. Kids that I get in my classroom are not the type of kids that want to sit in a classroom and just study math. They're the more hands-on. A lot of these kids are, might not go to a four-year college. But I also wanted to implement something that, that if the kids are going to go to a four-year, they could take the class and say, oh, I can see the value of it as well. That's why I wanted to implement all this stuff, to just bring something different to where the math, science, because that's where the state really wants us to go. And how can we do that so the kids can add value to it as well? Thank you, donors, for opening up a world of opportunity for our students. With time and continued support, these ideas could blossom into programs that could help every student at every school. Pre-K, kindergarten, summer school after-school homework labs and open libraries. Or even TEALS, a program that brings professionals into our high schools to teach computer science and web design. TEALS was piloted at Issaquah High School in 2010 and is creating the next generation of computer scientists here and nationwide. When you donate, our kids can say, I have a mentor. We love Shakespeare. My son was prepared to begin kindergarten. I can be the next great robot. We can change the world.